Congratulations! Special occasions happen all the time. And the most common thing Americans say in response to good news is, congratulations! So in this video, you'll learn how to correctly pronounce congratulations in American English. There are many happy occasions to congratulate someone on their achievements or milestones in life. Some examples include, someone had a baby, is pregnant, is getting married, got a new job, got a promotion, bought their first house, finished their master's degree, or graduated from college. What are some other happy moments you could congratulate someone on? For any of these special occasions, it's the perfect time to say, congratulations. I know that's a big word. Let's break it down into syllables. Con, gra, ch, le, shuns. Congratulations. There's five syllables in this word. Make sure to pronounce all five of them. Don't leave anything out. Now, primary stress is on lay, and any word ending in Asian will have the same stress pattern. Now, I'm sure you're aware of words like organization or vacation. They also have the stress on that A. For more information on word stress rules, check out my word stress videos. Did you notice? I used another word ending in Asian in that last sentence, and it wasn't even planned. What was it? You may have also noticed another unusual thing about the pronunciation of the word congratulations. The TU in the middle of the word is pronounced as a CH. It's pronounced CH. This happens to many words that have a TU in the middle such as in the words culture and situation. Take a look at my video on when TU is pronounced CH for more information on this topic. Now try it slowly with me. Congratulations. Congratulations. Now let's do it faster. Congratulations. Congratulations! How do you congratulate people in your language? Do you have a word that means congratulations? Or do you say something else? I'd love to learn what to say. Please write it for me in the comments section below. Now let's keep practicing that difficult word. I finally finished my master's degree. What can you say to me? Well, congratulations, of course. Say it. Did you say it? Okay. We're having a baby. Did you tell me congratulations? Congratulations. We got the house. Congratulations. Now, depending on the occasion, it's polite to ask follow-up questions. I'll talk about some good questions you can ask in my next video on making small talk with Americans. Now, congratulations for making it all the way through the end of this video.